Now we will see the real use of HP ZBook. Why we pick the Xeon processor and Quadro RTX? Because we want to do some 3D and visual effects work. So now for that, first let's see start Unreal Game Engine. And in that Unreal Game Engine, first we will load a fully light shaded and like fully ready asset and then we will see so our editor is now initializing let's just start the task manager also so we will see the same side by side what is the performance okay let's go to the performance tab and here we can see that all the cpus are actually nothing so here i have one project city subway train module and this is very interesting one actually let me just load that so city subway train modular is loading and in this side we can see that our cpu is going up and gpu is also two percent four percent so it's fine and this is actually a very gpu intensive task so definitely our gpu will be use utilize more our rtx will be utilized more okay so let's just put it here uh, maybe, yes no okay this is the problem with dual monitor okay now it's fine okay so let's just put our task manager in different monitor so that's here so here we can see this scene is loaded let's just hit play and when i hit play our cpu is 10 percent but gpu is start increasing all right now let's just try to play that wait uh, okay now let's just here you can see very smooth i can live playing inside unreal engine and this is the same CP gpu uses and cpu uses is also not that much here you can see right so i hope you are getting the idea about how performing how much performance ZBook is giving and this scene is quite heavy actually so yeah so I'm just playing here loaded the scene and this is quite interesting actually you know what let's just stop this and see the full 3d scene here so with that you can actually use uh, do all the 3d gaming stuff inside uh, your laptop and the laptop is can easily load all this stuff and the gpu rtx is really worth right let's just quickly see one more time how we can see this is the back front and i'm just rotating everywhere and you can see this lighting shading all looks good right okay so yeah this is the review for unreal engine inside rtx 4000 and our intel xeon processor okay now let's just continue with our next review which is using Houdini inside ZBook.